Hi everybody, so welcome back to my channel. So today is gratitude challenge day 16 and the theme was routine. And for me, I am a routine person, but I've already shared the school stuff with you guys. Um, I've shared a couple other things. Definitely not a beauty guru, but I thought I might show you guys like my 10 minute max, get ready with me, mommy, what I do. So, you guys can just see me in the bathroom, just getting ready, and, you guys hear that? I don't know what that was. Ooh. Anyway, so here is a really, it's like a simple 10 minute mom makeup. There you go. I hope you guys enjoy it. Yeah, and let's go ahead and get into the video. Okay, so here I am getting ready, just brush out all my hair, my son is asleep, so I usually have about five to 10 minutes just to get this done really fast. First thing I use is some eye cream that's from the pharmacy and it's in dewy eyes. And it's just an overnight cream, but I put it all over my eyes in the morning just because it helps my makeup set a little better. Make sure I got no sleepies and it's all rubbed in really well. And then I always use my beauty blender and I wet it before I even put my concealer on because I like to make sure it's nice and wet. And then I use the naked concealer. I have no idea what it's called. I'll put it in the link below. Put it on my eyes, around my chin and mouth, and some of my forehead. And that's pretty much in. And then I blend, blend, blend. I usually just use concealer because foundation is way too heavy for my pale skin. And then, after every single time that I use my beauty blender, I wash it with soap because germs are disgusting. Next, I put on tons of chapstick. Oh yeah, no, wait, I wipe that off first and then I do tons of chapstick because my lips get so dry. And then I put on blush. And my sister got me this makeup brush set from BH Cosmetics. And this is just my rose gold blush. And I put this on, so shout out to my sis. And I just put that on my cheeks, on my nose, and my forehead. I know that makes no sense, but it kind of makes me feel like there's some color coordination going on. And then I use my Pixie bronzer. And I put a little bronzer on just to make it look like I'm not so pasty pasty wet. Alright, and then let's do my hair really quickly before we do everything else. So, literally, to do the bun that I always do, I take all of my hair, flatten it out with my fingers, not even a brush, and then I spin it around. I put it on the top of my head, and I make a bun. Pull it out, fluff it out, pull out some little flyaways so it looks a little more messy. Pull it out so it's not so tight. There it is. That is the hair. And I think here's the chapstick. Oh no. Um, that is a chai. It's the brand is Bite, and I just outline it with a lipstick, because I like the color, and I think the color is Chai, and then I got it from Sephora for my birthday, but the company is Bite, and the color is Chai, and then this is the NYX Lip Cream in Istanbul, I think this is a really cute color combo, so I'll just do that really quickly, and I think the last thing I do is use the Better Than Sex Mascara, and I have my own little way of doing that, I put on two to three layers, get off all the goop, and everybody has a mascara face. You can see I'm definitely a professional when it comes to this stuff. In my downstairs bathroom, so my son can't hear me. <laughs> and then, yeah, I put on two or three layers and I really try and build this up. That's the one thing I do like about this mascara. It's super buildable. It's a little pricey, but I think it's worth it. And I do put it on the bottom as well. And I usually am listening to music, so I usually end up dancing a little bit as I do my makeup. And that is it. 
I'm all done. All right, so that is it. I hope you guys have a great day. Maybe you guys learned some tips. If you, I'm gonna link all the products I use below. I think that's how the beauty community does it. But I hope you guys have a good day. I'll see you later. Bye.